The University of Houston says they have created a fentanyl vaccine to keep people from overdosing on fentanyl. If approved, they hope it'll stop people from relapsing when they're trying to recover. Janelle Bluda got a chance to talk to one of the lead researchers on this project. The CDC says 107,000 people died of a drug overdose last year. 67% of that involved synthetic opioids like fentanyl. The target population is individuals that want to quit. Dr. Colin Hale with the University of Houston has been working on a project the past five years, developing a vaccine against fentanyl. We are using components uh, that are already in vaccines that are approved. He says the vaccine works by creating anti-fentanyl antibodies in the body that when the drug is consumed, the antibodies bind to the fentanyl and block its ability to enter the brain, eliminating the drug's euphoric or high feeling, and the drug is pushed out of the body through the kidneys. What is key is the prevention of fentanyl penetrating the brain. He says they've also created vaccines against methamphetamine and cocaine, but they are in different stages of development. He says the fentanyl vaccine can be used to keep those recovering from addiction from relapsing, but also as prevention for those who may unknowingly come in contact with a deadly substance like other users or even police officers. There's been a few stories about police and you know emergency responders being exposed to fentanyl unknowingly. Of all the vaccines, Dr. Hale believes the fentanyl vaccine has the best chance of making it to market. First, he says in a very hopeful timeline, they can start human trials in about a year and they hope it can be available to the public in three years. Back to you.